Welcome, as long as I show me Redmi Note 9 Pro and today I'll show you how to enable the do not disturb mode. So to get started, can pull down the notification panel and the toggle seems to be on a second page at the end right here. And before you actually toggle it, you want to hold it and, and here you have a couple of settings. Now once you tap on the DND, it automatically becomes enabled as you'll see right now. But it also gives you options right here. So uh, allow incoming calls and uh, by default set none, uh, but you can change it to any else right here so you have from stared contacts which is just favorite contacts only and anyone this the first one kind of defeats the purpose so choose whichever one you want then below that you have a notify about repeated calls now this will allow you to receive a call even though for instance the person calling you is not included in the list that you have set right here so you could have uh, set that no one can basically call you but if you have this on and that person calls you twice within a 15 minute period, they will you will actually be notified about it. So it's a good uh, way for to get notified about some kind of, for instance, emergency. Usually in those uh, situations, people do call multiple times in a quick succession. So this will be a really good option to have enabled just in case. And uh, then restrict the floating notifications. So this will just remove the notifications and below that you have schedule. Can tap on it and here you can uh, set up a schedule name it to whatever you want uh, days of the week you can choose in custom uh, every kind of day of the week that you want um, then you have start time and end time and then silent mode so choose whichever one you want uh, either the silent which will just be kind of like turning this on so now it's gonna be in silent uh, or being in do not disturb mode, which like I said before, gives you a little bit of customization uh, as we just did to it. And from there, tap on the check mark and it's all set and automatically becomes enabled. And if the time that we have set right here, so from 11 p.m. till 7 a.m. right now, so if it's in that time range, it will automatically turn on, on and then off at those specific times. And Apart from it basically being set to automatically, you can still just simply tap on the toggle to turn it on whenever you need it and then tap on it again to turn it off. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.